the summer green forests of temperate climates sparkle in the softened rays of the sun like a French impressionistic canvas. How inviting, yet how impregnable and forbidding were the trees of the unbroken wilderness in the early years of our nation. At first, riverways were the main access. Eventually, deer trails yielded to man's pathways, and the pathways led to the hunter's cabins, which became settlements. Of course, any student of American history or literature is familiar with the story of the invaders of the nation's primeval forests. Now, let's explore America's eastern deciduous forest. The eastern deciduous forest occupies about one-fifth of the North American continent, which includes the southeastern portions of Canada and the easternmost one-third of the contiguous United States. Deciduous forests occupy temperate latitudes worldwide, including Great Britain, France, Germany, and in eastern Asia. We will examine the eastern deciduous forests of North America. <laughs> 